How's it going everyone? Welcome to Manny Subscribe League. Before we start, I'm on, you know, the Steelers because we got a brand new person in the draft class. If we go to the center, we got Mitsa Malik. He's a, he's the first ever offensive lineman in the Manny Subscribe League as a whole. And guess what? He's projected to be in the mid first, mid third round, the late third round. But his talent is an early first rounder. He could be the greatest offensive lineman of all time. And since he looks like he's projected to go in the third round, he could be the biggest deal in the draft. And also, we also got a couple new quarterbacks in the draft class. We got none other than Harry Potter himself. And then, uh, who came back from Madden 20. In Madden 20, he debuted in Season 2 for the Dolphins as an undrafted free agent. He balled out in the Dolphins for a little bit, choked in the playoffs, got cut by the Dolphins. Played for the Saints, balled out for the Saints, and also choked in the playoffs again. So Harry Potter's a decent quarterback, which is not good for the playoffs. But can he change that in, in Madden 21? Next up, coming back from, you know, Madden, th Madden 20 Season 3. Rodrigo Yu-Gi-Oh! debuted in Season 3. Ball, you know, he did pretty alright for the Jets, but since he played for, you know, the Jets, you know, they fucking did awful. So Rodrigo Yu-Gi-Oh! You're back, and hopefully you get drafted to a better team. <laughs> This is the quarterback draft class, though. It's looking crazy. We got Go to Fight Kev, Turmoil, Turmoil, Nick Alonzo, Easton Westchurk, Harry Potter, and Yu-Gi-Oh! They could be the best quarterbacks of all time. Right now, today, we're going to be looking at one game. And may, are we going to look at one game? I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out in the end. So right here, league schedule. If we look at this. Uh, we got the Dolphins versus Crusaders. Which, um, by the way, I know this is a division matchup they face off, like, twice a year. But, you know, we're going to we'll look at this one. And in Week 8, we're going to look at this one, the Patriots and Crusaders. If, you, if you're getting tired of Crusaders content, I'm sorry. But they, it's, it's a quarterback versus quarterback subscriber matchup, and we can't miss it. It's a can't miss. But, like, I will record other teams. It's just, like, you know, they're in the, like, some some, some subscriber teams, like the Lions. Their only subscriber is a defensive tackle. So, sometimes I have to rely on subscriber for subscriber matchups. Because, otherwise, if it's just a non-subscriber for a subscriber matchup. And the only subscriber is the defensive tackle. Then it's going to be a boring game. That's all I can say. So, right now, um, yeah, that's going to be fun. Now, now if we go into the, if we go into the roster real quick. You can see that for the starting quarterback for the Miami Dolphins is none other than the first overall pick in season one, Nicholas Rizon. It shows to a tackle level for him because he's the higher overall. But Nicholas Rizon, he's the better one, in my opinion. And probably to a tackle level is probably going to get like, cut after this season because Rizon is already leading the team to 4 and 2. And then we got the running back. Dodeca Kokomeka again is showing Gatson over Coco because, you know, Gatson's the higher overall, but Dodeca's starting. So Dodeca is a 76 overall, so that is fun. And hopefully he balls out. And now, if we go to the, you know, the Crusaders, which is, you know, the formerly the New York Jets, Tommy Angio is supposed to replace the franchise. You know, he's a 77 overall. He's kind of doing all right, so his, his, his team is 2-2. Two and two. And his back is Garner Minshew the second, so in case if Tommy gets out, then they have him to rely on. But hopefully, you know, hopefully stuff works out as right now. You know, if we go into the AFC East, which is probably one of the only divisions where a subscribe at least one subscriber is on at least one team, the Crusaders are two and three. They kind of need some W's in order to make the playoffs, and so do the Patriots and Bills. But the Dolphins, they, if they keep this up, they could win the division. The Patriots, though, they started off 2-0, and oh, but on a three-game losing streak. And then the Crusaders lost a recent game. So right now, I know I did a lot of rambling, but I just need y'all to get ca caught up on this stuff. Anyway, let's get into the actual matchup. Alrighty, and now here it is. We're live in San Diego, California. It's the Miami Dolphins versus the San Diego Crusaders. It, there's the head coach for the Crusaders. It's Coach Tibbetts, who's going to... Who's, his first tenure here as a coach, and hopefully he coaches Tommy and Gio, who's who was right there, number six, uh, you know, a two two, you know, a Super Bowl. As right now, here is comes the Miami Dolphins. They had the number one overall pick, and right now they're winning their division. Right now, there is Matt Patrick, the current coach of the 
Miami Dolphins and in IRL he's the coach of the Lions but I guess he got fired as the Lions and you know went to the Dolphins so right now it's gonna be a battle between two two quarterbacks in man two legendary quarterbacks in Madden 20 Nicholas Rizon was the fit was the was everyone's favorite quarterback in Madden 20 and Tommy and Joe was statistically the best one where he won MVP in his rookie year Nicholas Rizon's number six and Tommy's also number six wow look at that and Dodeca is number 29, so that's all you need to know. Alright, and since this is the only matchup we're going to record, we're going to watch the whole thing. Why not? No, I don't, I don't want to fucking... I don't, I don't want to watch this shit. End the game. Oh yeah, we got to watch the fucking punt. <laughs> yeah, man, who likes the fucking punt? You know, if this... If it, if it leads to, you know, getting a blowout, I'll simulate some parts of it. How about that? So right here... There he comes. How about the Miami Dolphins? They coming out. As here comes Nicholas Rizon. His current season right now is 1,528 yards, 12 touchdowns, 6 interceptions. Pretty good for the Miami Dolphins starting QB. There's Nicholas Rizon. As here comes Rizon. He's out on the bat. Nicholas Rizon. What we do? He's going to run this off with not Dodeca. I literally have Dodeca starting. Stop using Gatson. Bro, what do I need to do for them to not use fucking Gatson? Right now, Mr. Nicholas Riz, I'm gonna pass it in. And he breaks off a tackle. Wow. Right now, Mr. Tommy NGO. He is going to... He's gonna, you know, they're gonna run in with Gatson. Do I have Dodeca starting? Do I have, do I have Dodeca starting? Cause why are they not using him? Oh, they have him starting. They have him starting. All right, screw you, Gatson. You're, you're going on the, you're going on, you're, you're, you're going on the deep depths. There, now no one's gonna use you. Now, now they'll have to, use, now they have to use Dodeca. Ha ha, there we go. I'm a fucking genius. Do this again. Alright, right now, Mr. Oh, why is Gatson still out there? What? Ain't no way. Oh, Stiff's arm ran to the ground, though. I think that's Dodeca's number. I hope. Yep, that's Dodeca. He's supposed to block. He's gonna wobble that out into the sidelines you know that's pretty good pretty good decision from Nicholas Rizon because otherwise he would have had to you know take the sack and taking sacks is not, no good and that's get nearly gets interception that's gonna get deflected they can't go for a field goal right here it's too far away right now right now Rizon what are you doing as he's gonna fumble it is this time they're gonna get the ball back Fourth and 25, we are not watching a punt, because punts are boring, and stupid, and boring, boring, and no one likes punts. Listen. Right now, the Crusaders are at their own seven yard line, as right now, they're going to get taken down by, there's Tommy's running back, Jason, R I mean, yeah, running back, Jason Rattler, still, still Chain Chomp's name. But hey, he's all, he's he loves to rattle stuff, I guess. Is that a first down? I think so. But hey, I know the football season, it's happening right now, but why not watch more football by watching the Madden Subscriber League? Why not? Tommy, what are you doing, kid? What are you doing? This is a, That is not one of the things you should be able to do. Alright. So right now, Mr... Nicholas Rizon has the ball. It is zero to zero. They're gonna run this in with Dodeca Coco Mecca finally doing shit. It is second and third. As Mr. Nicholas Rizon has the ball. Rizon, what will he do? He's gonna throw in a dot. Look at Rizon. Will he? Th will he throw a touchdown? Alright, right now they're gonna run this in with Dodeca! Second and seven. 
as right now. No, it's second and ten. Huh. Well, if you look at that. They're going to run this in with Dodeca Coco Mecca. Right now, Nicholas Rizon has the ball. Rizon going to throw it in. And that's going to be good. He's going to hold on deep to that. They're in field goal range now. And that's going to be the end of the first quarter. Okay. So what will Nicholas Rizon do? As right now, Rizon. Alright, Rizon. You know, did pretty. You know, he ran it off with Odeka, which is pretty good. Rizon has the ball. Rizon going to throw it in. Let's go. Now, right now, Nicholas Rizon has the ball. Rizon, Rizon, Rizon gonna throw it into the curl route. Alright, what else will Nicholas Rizon and Mr. Dodeca Coco Mecca will do? Right now, Dodeca! Oh, he gets hit sticked. He's, is he good? Dodeca, is you good? Do, do you need help? Damn, he got he got bodied. Which is what Nicholas Rizon gonna... Alright, that was number 82, so he didn't put out his hands. That would have been a touchdown. Third and goal. Pass it in for a touchdown. That would be simple. Right now, gonna run it in with their backups. That's gonna be an easy touchdown. Dolphins. Look at that. They're gonna kick an that field goal. They won't. But guess what? You know what? Fuck it. End the game. And guess what? I'm I'm we're how much is let the let the game do the thing. Guess what? How much is if it I'll let it, you know, watch the punts because some people are actually into punts for some reason. I don't know what fucking madman does that, but you know, they exist. Right now Mr. Tommy NGO has the ball. Seems like they're going run heavy as they're going to do play action. And that's easily caught. Oh my god. How did he catch that? Oh, I thought they were in punting formation. I was about to say. Tommy NGO throws it in. Wide open man. It's right now. Tibbets right here. He's just analyzing the play. Wondering what exactly is he going to do next? Hmm. I don't know, but whatever it is, it is what it is, right there. Third and fourth. Right now, Tommy and Gio gonna pass it in. That was a good pass from Tommy NGO. Right now, Tommy NGO gonna pass it in to number 16. That's good, Tommy. He just needs some pretty, he just needs time. Because if you remember, in Madden 20, at mostly every time Tommy. Is that an interception? Ain't no. That's going to be an interception. Holy shit. Never mind. Tommy throws a pick. I was about to say, Tommy, Rizon, what are you doing? But, you know, Rizon in, not Rizon, Tommy in Madden 20, mostly every match he plays, he always comes in clutch. He's the clutch man. Right now. Right now. Oh, shit. I realize it's almost the end of the second quarter. Oh, shit. Right now, the Miami Dolphins are going to call that time out. Right now, what is Rizon going to do? Rizon has the ball. Rizon going to pass it in. And he's going to... Is that good? Hey, is that a good pass? I don't know. Right now, first and ten. 
the Dolphins, they, they, only, they only have one more timeout left. The Crusaders, they ain't going to intercept it, but Rizon's doing good. He's throwing in deep passes. They just need one more yard to get into field goal range. They ain't going to use this timeout just yet. Maybe once he catches the pass, maybe... Oh! Oh, it, does he get the first down? I don't know. But guess what? They're gonna use the timeout. Will they kick in this field goal? Will they kick? Will they kick it in? Will they kick it in? Yes, they will. They will kick it in from the 26-yard line. Will it get blocked? You've seen blocked field goals before, as this one ain't gonna get blocked. But it is gonna be good. 10 to 0 is the score as of right now. Right here. Right now, Tibbets and Tommy, they need to figure out how how will they do how will they come back? Tommy, he always came back in Madden 20. How will he come back this time? Right now. To, oh, the rushing yards for the Crusaders is literally five. Let's look at this halftime report. We got games around the league. We got the Patriots versus them Cowboys. How's that going? Nah, I don't know. I think they're just highlighting that. I don't fucking know. I'm not a commentator. Oh, I think they're taking a taking a look at upcoming games. All right, and the Bills and Chargers. That's looking pretty. You know, that's gonna be a good matchup in Super Mario Mendes versus Chargers. Then we got the football team who's facing on against William Palomino. That's looking lit like the lits. Any other anything you need? No. Um. Uh, I forgot what his name is. I know he used to be the commentator commentator for WWE. But yeah. Right now, they're going to do a punt return. Punt returns are sometimes interesting because they could be returned for a touchdown. But the, we rarely see that ever happen in Madden. So right now, Dennard, he's going to average 23 yards, you know, you know, per return. Tommy, he needs to make something happen. He already threw one interception. That's going to be a flag on the play. Who's it on? I have the feeling that there's a lot of shouting, screaming, people upset. That's gonna be on the offense. Ain't no way, Tommy. What are you guys doing? Come on, the offensive lineman needs to stop, you know, holding. Like Tommy and Gio, though. He's gonna throw it deep. Look at that. Tommy already at second and six when he was at first and 20. Look at that. Fun. Right now, they're gonna run this in as he has all the room in the world. He has all the room. As that's going to be a first down from Mr. Jason Rattler. Right now, they're going to run this in with Jason Rattler. Second and seven. As right now, what else is going to happen in this game? Right now, they keep they're gonna they're gonna keep going run heavy. They trust their running back Rattler and more. But it's 32. I feel like they should not run it this time. I feel like they should just pass it, maybe for a quick slant. As right now, ooh, Rattler actually has some room. So right now, right now, Tommy and Gio, he's gonna throw it deep. And that's going to be good. Tommy Angio clutches it up. Well, they ain't clutch it up yet. They need a touchdown. That's what they need. Clearly. That's what they... No, really. That's what they need. In order to win the game. Rattler. Oh, my God. Rattler. Right now, Tommy, they're going to run this in. How is that not a touchdown? Ain't no way. Second and goal. Second and goal. Right now, Rattler. That is going to be touchdown, Crusaders. Jason Rattler is going to put it in for the touchdown. They're going to kick in this field goal to make it a three-point game. Boom, gonna kick it in, and that is going to be good. Look at that. 
Right now, the Miami Dolphins need to know how will they, you know, how will they defend the lead. I kind of want to see what the Crusaders are planning on doing now. As right now, here comes, all right, here comes the Miami Dolphins offense needing to do something so they can prevent the Crusaders from, you know, getting up to them. Right now, they're gonna dump this off to the deck as he's gonna get destroyed. Oh my God. Right now, they're gonna run this in with Dodeca again. No, that ain't Dodeca. That's Gaston. I literally put you deep on the bench. How are you still playing? Right now, it's third and nine. Rizon needs something to happen. They're gonna pass it in. Is that a first down? Not a first down, right? That's a first down. Look at that. Of course, the Crusaders still have so much time left on the clock for, you know. To stop the Dolphins. Who knows? Right now, Riz, I'm gonna throw it into literally no one. Who was he throwing to? Come on, Riz, on. You're better than that. Well, I know that for something. I know that Riz, on is gonna throw a good pass. Never mind. He's gonna. That's gonna get broken up by the defensive back or the cornerback. I don't. I don't fucking know. But Riz, on. He's gonna. They're just going pass heavy now. Rizon, oh, they choke. They choke. They have to punt this away. They actually have to punt it away. Boom, punts it away. That is going to be... Instead of doing a fair catch, they're just going to get like two yards. Return. Rizon gonna run, I mean not Rizon, Tommy is gonna run this in to end off the first, the third quarter. Now it's the fourth quarter, Tommy needs something. He needs something to happen on this drive. If he doesn't, you know, bad stuff's gonna happen to the, to the Crusaders. They could miss the playoffs. Who knows? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Right now here's third and three. They could easily run this in or just run a quick slant. Just depends. They're going to run this in. Did he get it in? Fourth and one. Do they? Are they going to punt it? They're punting this. Oh, shit. Right now, punt it away to the Dolphins. Who Dolphins? Let's go. Um, How will the Dolphins, you know, will the Dolphins not choke? Right now, they're going to stop Dodeca on the run. Right now, Rizon. Rizon, he's going to. That's going to be first and ten. Right now. Oh! Right here, that is gonna be a gain of a couple yards. Second and six, gain of four yards. The Crusaders, they need to stop the Dolphins. They need to find some way to stop the Dolphins. Whether it be from, oh, fumble! Tommy can't, Tommy team picks it up. The Crusaders picks it up. Fox, Fox saves the Crusaders. Tommy, save, save the Crusaders. Save them from this game. Yo, I don't know who fumbled that, but whoever fumbled that, they, they're probably getting cut. Fumble again. Back-to-back -back fumbles. God damn it, Tommy. You blew it. Now the, now the, now the Crusaders, they need, a, they need a field goal to just tie it up. Or maybe even take the touchdown to, oh, oh, breaks off multiple tackles. Oh, my God. Bro, the Dolphins, they're trying to win this game. Riz on. They're going pass. I guess they're going to pass on this play. Oh, that's... Just 
Two minute warning. I feel like, is this the part where they're gonna you do pass, like run heavy, so they can waste out some clock? Right now, they're gonna run this in, Dodeca gets immediately stopped, they're gonna use a timeout. Right now, Rizon gonna pass, gonna pass it in. That's a touchdown. Ain't no way. And he's gonna do the nay nay. I don't believe that for a moment. Wait, wait, hold on. Was that a touchdown? Hold on, was that a touchdown? I gotta see that shit from my own eyes. Hold on. Alright, gonna hide that. Was that a touchdown? I don't, I think his two feet were out of bounds, right? Alright. Wait, oh, we got one foot on the ground for a moment, wait. All right, gotta look at the two feet. Oh, oh, he technically, wait, is his feet, uh, his toes are trailing on the ground. That is indeed gonna be a touchdown. Oh wait, no, the game is just automatically gonna do a booth review. Is that a touchdown? It's a touchdown. Wow. Wow, look at that, huh? Huh? All right, how will the, how will Tommy come back from this? I mean, I feel like this is the part. Yep, this is the, yep. Why would you all run in when when there's not really that much time left? Doesn't matter. Miami Dolphin wins. Look at that. The Dolphins are five and two, while the Crusaders still trailing behind. Hmm. Okay then. So right now, ooh, Tommy did not have a good game and passed for only a hundred yards and an interception. Nicholas Rizon, two hundred yards, one touchdown, zero interceptions. Dodeca had a terrible game. Oh my god, well, what was that? But yeah, otherwise let's just go to next week. All right, we are back, and now Dodeca, he's pissed. He's pissed with the Dolphins. What do you have to say? Coach, I noticed you totally coming out of the game plan. It makes me think I'm not doing my job. I'm not asking you to be the centerpiece of the team, but I do want to contribute however I can. So get me more involved in offense this week. Get, <coughs> get him involved. <coughs> Frick. I hear you, Matt Patrick. He hears him 100%. I'll do my best to incorporate you in the game plan this week, okay? That's what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Coach. You talk to Dodeca and prove his spirits. Give Dodeca 12 plus touches or 100 plus rushing yards, receiving yards. Okay then, that's good. So now they gotta pray. Now Dodeca, if he wants, if he wants to continue being on the Dolphins, you know, then he give him more playing time. You know what? We're gonna start off right here. I'm gonna help the Dolphins a tiny bit right here with that. Gatson, get out of here. There we go. Now Dodeca, now he has no excuse. If you start, if you run in more with airs, I'm about to be pissed with this game. But right now, let's actually check the schedule. The league schedule. Let's see how week eight. Week eight. We are recording this game right here. The the New England Patriots versus them San Diego Crusaders. Right now, the Patriots got blown out by them Cowboys, huh? Yo. Alright, any anything else? The Bears, they beat the Vikings by a point. Holy shit. Ignacio's team lost to the Falcons. Hmm. Anything else? The Eagles, you know, the one with... Oh, damn, they, they had a shootout with the Giants. Oh, my God. The Broncos, they cycle him. David and Monk's team lose to Riquiz Barkley. You know, Salvacano and Ellie Rodriguez's team loses to the Cardinals. Super Mario Mendez beats the Chargers. Tommy, I mean, the college team lost the Bengals. And then, oh, the Palomino's team beats the football team. And then we already know how this one goes. So right now, after week eight, I'm going to do a mid-season report. After, after next episode, I'm going to do mid-season report cards and maybe look at a game that we haven't checked out from a subscriber yet. So that'd be fun. Anyway... Um, thank you all so much for watching. Come on, subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.